weight loss there. Well, one local family reunited with their lost pet after more than half a decade. Microchip technology made it possible after the dog showed up at the vet's office an hour and a half away. Can you imagine that the dog found his way? Box 54's Lex Juarez talked to the family and met the pup who certainly defied the odds. You know, this isn't that unusual. We tend to see stories like this happening all over the country, but it's very interesting to find one right here at home. Seven years. Seven years. A long time for a pet to be missing. Amanda Aiken and her family thought they'd never see their dog Rose again after the day she ran off. She had got out the door that morning when I was taking my daughter to school and um, had a phone call and, and said that they had my dog. I went to the house that said they had my dog and they actually said they let her go. So, and I never seen her after that. Until three weeks ago when a vet in Columbia, South Carolina called her and said they had Rose. It didn't even click at first because I, you know, seven years goes by. Even after all that time, Rose's microchip led the vet to her owner. I will never not get a, another animal microchip because of that. Because you never know. The technology leads to reunions like this all the time. I've had multiple cases where pets have been brought in for an exam, a procedure, and we scan them and find out they are microchipped. Recently, Dr. Berkshire said a microchip helped a hurricane evacuee get their cat back. She said she's never seen a case where a pet had been missing as long as Rose. It's mind-boggling, and it's, it's very exciting, but it's a real testament to the value of having a permanently identified pet with a microchip. Microchipping is the way to go. And even though the dog wasn't taken care of like she should have been, she wasn't in the best conditions. She was malnourished, had some bed sores, and was diagnosed with heartworms also. So she hadn't been taken care of. She had a chain around her neck. I don't know if she was dropped off or... You know, she escaped wherever she was, but I went and picked her up, and here she is. Aiken says she's just as sweet as before. She's the same loving, caring dog that she has been. In New Ellington, Lex Juarez, Fox 54 News Now.